Hello everyone. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we are going to consider the merge operator. So merge operator basically is used to perform the sync up of two tables. Here we have two tables. One is the source and one is the destination. Now you can see the data present in the source and destination tables is different. So what we want over here is the data in the destination table should get changed and should match source table. Right. So here initially you can see that for employee ID one here employee name is Vinod H. Punjabi, but here it's Vinod. So in the destination table, this record should get updated employee ID one. This should get updated. So this is the first thing that we want to perform. Along with that, the second thing which we want to perform is this record with employee ID three is extra in the destination table. So this should get removed. Okay. So this is the second step. Alex will be deleted. What is the third step we need to do? We need to insert a new record, which is the new record to John. Now this record should get inserted in the destination table. So at the end of this merge operator, the final result which we should get is here. One Vinod Punjabi should come, which will come post update for this employee ID. And this three Alex will be removed, right? That will happen through delete. And through insert, two John will be added over here. So this is the result which we will get post the merge operator. So let's see a demo of this. We now have uh, two tables. One is the source and one is the target. Now, how do we perform the merge operator that we are going to see a demo? This is our uh, data before running the merge operator. So here you can see the same example which we considered in the Excel. Uh, we have over here Vinod Punjabi and John and here we have Vinod Alex. So now whatever is the data which is in the source, this should come in the target as well. So now let's see how to achieve this. For that you have to write merge operator and you have to define two tables. One is the target table, one is the source table. So I'm giving this suffix as target and source table. I'm giving the suffix as source and we have to specify a column based on which we are going to compare. I mean, whether we have to perform delete or insert or update based on which column we have to decide. So I will consider over here employee ID. Now we have to give two scenarios. One is uh, three scenarios. One is insert, one is update, one is delete. Let's consider one by one. Now, in which scenario will we perform the insert? So we will perform insert when there is a record present in source, but not in the destination. So what we will say when not matched by target, that means that record is not present in the destination. So at that time we will perform an insert and what would be the values? It will be the values from the source, source employee, ID, source employee. Name. Let's move to second scenario, which is update. In update, what we will do will update the targets employee name from source employee name. Right. So we have to say when matched when employee IDs are matching in that case. Now, which is the third scenario? The third scenario is the case when we have to delete the records. Now, in which case will we delete the records? We'll delete the records when there are some extra records in the destination, but not present in the source. So in that case, we'll perform a delete. So what we have to write when not matched by source, that means there are some additional records in the destination. In that case, we have to perform delete. So once we run this, right, we'll get source and destination as same. Now, this is the current state of the tables. Now, if we run this, right, it says three rows affected. And if we run this, now you can see both source and target 
have the same data so this was a demo of merge operator thank you so i hope you would have liked this video so if you want me to make a video on any particular topic just write that in the description box and please please like this video and do subscribe this channel thank you